Hello, I'm Tom Hathaway. I'm wearing my BA hat to symbolize that anyone in an organization might do business analysis, whether or not they have the job title business analyst. So let's talk business analysis. This knowledge nugget presents how to create a rigorous physical process model, which, you will discover, is an easy to learn entree into the world of data flow diagramming, business process analysis, and workflow analysis. We'll address what a rigorous physical process model is, what it represents, and why you need one. We'll even walk you through the process of creating one based on interview notes from a project sponsor. This powerful visualization technique will help you when you are the one wearing the BA hat. A rigorous physical process model shows the movement of physical objects and data amongst the units in an organization. The idea is to represent the real world as closely as possible. Given that the proposed information technology, or IT solution, will need to know something about the physical objects, these will have to be represented in data as well. The power of a rigorous physical process model lies in its simplicity. It only allows two symbols, a circle to represent people or places, and an arrow representing the movement of physical material or data. This simplicity makes it easy to implement, and it is an ideal starting point for a context-level data flow diagram. Now that you know the symbols for creating a rigorous physical process model, I'd like to walk you through the exercise of analyzing a situation to create one using a standard scenario from our instructor-led class. We'll use a transcript of an interview with the manager of the order entry department, Mary, the project sponsor. My approach is to read the text and look for people and places that I want to represent in my diagram. I'll try my best to identify all of them, but don't have to be perfect as this is my first cut at it.